Hello friends, welcome back to Genuine Core YouTube channel. This is the fourth video in the Java webcam tutorial series. And in the last video, we have created our own video feed GUI using Java threads and uh, we uh, completed that. And in this video, I will use the webcam panel, which is a class provided by the Sarsos library, which is much more simple to use. So, uh, in order to implement the previous uh, our own GUI, we had to code a little bit, but this is much more simple. So, let us create that. For that, I am going to create a new Java class. I am not going to create a JFrame home. I am going to create a Java class and webcam panel tutorial. So, let the name of the class be webcam panel tutorial. And I need a public static void name here. So, public static void must be nice. So, uh, let's do the coding. The first thing we want to do is the first thing we want to do is we have to create the webcam object just like we did before so webcam webcam equals webcam static method get default so webcam dot get default then we will get webcam and next thing is we have to webcam dot set the view size so in my case i am going to set it as the vga size so webcam resolution there is a class called webcam webcam resolution dot vga which is 640 by 480 dot get size so now the webcam part is completed now we have to create a jframe also so jframe frame equals new jframe for creating a frame in java and in save that frame we will add it uh, so frame dot uh, set location relative to null which is used for setting the frame in the center of the screen then frame dot pack will automatically pack the size and uh, frame dot set visible will make the frame visible and in between creating a webcam object and creating a frame we have to use the webcam panel which is a very good implementation for displaying a video feed or image in uh, pure J java swing so uh, webcam panel webcam panel equals new webcam panel and it takes a webcam object so webcam panel and uh, this will be okay so now webcam panel and then what we have to do is we have to add this webcam panel into the frame because currently there is no connection between this webcam panel and this shape frame so i'm going to add that webcam panel here so there is an error so let's see what it is so okay it doesn't does accept the components that way we have to use this method frame dot add and here we can add the webcam panel and this webcam panel also provides number of uh, options so webcam panel dot if you s there is a number of set methods so uh, set mirrored actually mirrors the image i will uh, show you a, it a little bit later so image size displayed if you set this to true you will get the size of the current image in this bottom portion let's see uh, what's the output currently? So let's run the webcam panel tutorial. So run. So I got this image, and here it is, uh, because of this line set image displayed, I am uh, image size displayed. I am getting this 640 by 480 pixel, which is the size of this video feed. So that's it. Uh, that's about the set image displayed. Then there is uh, some other method. Uh, webcam dot set and uh, 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 there is a fps limit and there is fps displayed so how many frames are captured in a second can be displayed using this set fps fps mean frame per second so if i set it is fps is equal to true then uh, uh, there is one more thing I actually uh, when I close the program it didn't exit that is because I haven't set default close operations jframe dot exit on close so if I add this lane whenever I uh, press this button of my program it will actually close if I don't put this it will be actually uh, running in the background so that's it uh, wait for a second I am going to open the camera and as you can see we have added the frame per second here so uh, because of this line we are getting the size and we because of this line we are getting the fps 
now there is an option called uh, mirror image so actually uh, if you uh, psychologically if you set an image into mirror mode you will find yourself more handsome and beautiful because in all your life you have been seeing you in the mirror so actually the mirror uh, applies the mirroring effect so you are seeing actually the mirrored image of your image so if you see non mirrored image you will uh, feel like um, it's not that good image so that's why latest camera softwares are actually mirroring the image so for that uh, i'm going to set the webcam panel dot webcam panel dot set mirrored if i set it to mirror then i will get the mirror, mirror image let's see that so this is it this is the mirrored image actually in the last video i mean when i run the la uh, previous section the door was in this direction now it's on that so the image is mirrored so uh, i uh, I suggest you try the mirroring effect because that will make you much more handsome. So that's it. So we set the webcam panel dot set mirror and still there is some more option webcam panel dot set debug uh, no it's a debug display debug info. This will uh, print some debug information in the screen which will be useful if you are uh, concerned about the debug information I mean it is actually the repaint per second repaint means uh, just like SPS how many how many times in seconds the image is taken out of the J frame and uh, to, uh, repainted so I think this is the end of this video because um, uh, this was a simple implementation I hope you understood how to use the J uh, webcam panel and as always thank you for watching this video in the next video you will see more about the Java webcam capture and uh, under the